welcome everyone in the 9 plus ccp mcq series and in this particular video we will see mcqs of foundation of algorithm which is unit number 1 of your csc 408 course first question is who is the father of algorithm very fundamental question correct option will be option number c donald knuth is the father of algorithm next question which algorithm is known for its efficient sorting by partitioning the array into smaller parts? Is it merge sort, quick sort, bubble sort or insertion sort? Correct option will be option B. Quick sort is, the, is known for its efficient sorting by partitioning the array into smaller parts. Coming to the next question. What is the purpose of using big O notation in the algorithm analysis? Option is to represent the worst case time complexity or to represent the best case time complexity or to represent the average case time complexity. Correct option will be option A. Big O notation is used for representing the worst case time complexity of an algorithm. Okay. Next question. What is the time complexity of the best case scenario of quick sort for quick sort? So question is about best case scenario time complexity of quick sort. Correct option will be option A, big O of n log n. Guys, read the question carefully. Question was about best case scenario. If the question is about what is the time complexity of quick sort, means the question is asking about worst case time complexity. And in that case, correct option was option B big O of n square. Because the big O of n square is the time complexity of the quick sort in the worst case scenario okay next question which technique is used to solve recurrence relation involving divide and conquer algorithm option is master theorem option b merge sort option c quick sort and last option is bubble sort correct option is option number a master theorem guys see one thing master theorem is very important from your unit number one nothing is there in the unit number one do all these questions which i am discussing in this video and go and watch a videos on master theorem and practice some mcqs on master theorem you will do better in the unit number one later we will discuss mcqs of unit number two and three and there we will discuss the important parts of those two units so in the first unit master theorem is very important you can see uh, you will find the two or three mcqs of master theorem in your exam next question what type of generating function is used to count objects of a certain type? Option is ordinary generating function. Option B exponential generating function. Option C is trigonometric generating function. And last option is polynomial generating function. Correct option will be option A ordinary generating functions. Next question. Which function helps in solving recurrence relation by representing sequences as a power series? Correct option is option B, exponential generating functions. Next question. What is the standard scale used for analyzing asymptotic, asymptotic behavior in algorithm? Option is linear scale, option B, logarithmic scale, option C, exponential scale and last option is polynomial scale. Option B will be correct here. Logarithmic scale is used for analyzing asymptotic behavior in algorithm next question which type of tree is used for efficient searching and insertion operations is it binary trees avl trees b trees or tri trees correct option is option a binary trees is used for efficient searching and insertion operation next question what is the average path length in in a binary search tree with n nodes very basic question option b will be correct here big o of log n is the correct option next question what is the time complexity of merge sort now the question is about time complexity of merge sort nothing is mentioned here is it worst case or best case so if nothing is mentioned means question is about worst case time complexity so correct option is option number b big o of n log n is the time complexity of merge sort Coming to the next question, which theorem provide a way to solve certain types of recurrence relations? Now again the question is about master theorem. Master theorem will be correct here. Next question, what is the purpose of analyzing the asymptotic behavior of algorithm? 
ऑप्शन डी विल बी करेक्ट हेयर वी एनालाइज द ए सिंपटोटिक बिहेवियर ऑफ एल्गोरिदम टू कंपेयर द इफिशियंसी ऑफ डिफरेंट एल्गोरिदम बाई फाइंडिंग टाइम कंप्लेक्सिटी एंड स्पेस कंप्लेक्सिटी ओके नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वट इज द टाइम कंप्लेक्सिटी ऑफ क्विक शॉर्ट इन द वर्स्ट केस सिनारियो सो वेरी सिंपल क्वेश्चन टाइम कंप्लेक्सिटी ऑफ क्विक शॉर्ट इज बिग ऑफ एन स्क्वायर सो ऑप्शन सी विल बी करेक्ट हियर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच ट्री स्ट्रक्चर इज यूज टू रिप्रेजेंट हाइरिकल डेटा इन कंप्यूटर साइंस ऑप्शन ए बाइनरी ट्री ऑप्शन बी ट्राई ट्री ऑप्शन सी बी ट्री एंड लास्ट ऑप्शन इज एवियल ट्री करेक्ट ऑप्शन विल बी ऑप्शन ए बाइनरी ट्री इज यूज टू रिप्रेजेंट हाइरिकल डेटा इन कंप्यूटर साइंस नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच टेक्निक इज यूज टू एनालाइज द इफिशियंसी ऑफ एल्गोरिदम बाई फोकसिंग ऑन देयर बिहेवियर एज इनपुट साइज अप्रोच इज इन्फिनिटी करेक्ट ऑप्शन विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर ए ए सिंपटोटिक एनालिसिस इज यूज टू एनालाइज द इफिशियंसी ऑफ एल्गोरिदम ओके कमिंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वट इज द पर्पज ऑफ यूजिंग द मास्टर थ्यूरम इन एल्गोरिदम एनालिसिस ऑप्शन ए टू सॉल्व रेकरेंस रिलेशन ऑप्शन बी to analyze the average case time complexity option c to compute the exact running time of an algorithm and last option is to perform binary search correct option is option number a master theorem is used to solve the recurrence relation very simple question guys this series which is a 9 plus cgp mcq series which go uh, will go till your interim exam so make sure to subscribe the channel in order to gain 9 plus cgp ओके नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच फंक्शन इज यूज टू काउंट ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ अ सर्टेन टाइप इन जनरेटिंग फंक्शन ऑप्शन ए ऑर्डिनरी जनरेटिंग फंक्शन ऑप्शन बी एक्सपोनेंशियल जनरेटिंग फंक्शन ऑप्शन सी पोलिनोम जनरेटिंग फंक्शन लास्ट ऑप्शन इज ट्राइगोनोमेट्रिक जनरेटिंग फंक्शन करेक्ट ऑप्शन विल बी ऑप्शन ए ऑर्डिनरी जनरेटिंग फंक्शन कमिंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इन मर्ज शॉर्ट वट इज द साइज ऑफ सब प्रॉब्लम इन ईच रिकर्जन very simple question option a will be correct here half of the size of original problem is the size of sub problem in each recursion if you talk about merge sort next question which of the following is not a type of tree discussed in algorithm analysis option d will be correct here binary heap okay so this was uh, no one more question is there no this was the last question thank you so much for watching the videos guys we will later we will see two more videos in which we will discuss unit number 2 and unit number 3 mcqs so make sure to watch those videos go to the playlist you will find those videos thank you so much for watching the videos bye bye